we learnt about a command called SCP, which is basically used for transferring data from one machine to another securely, or it uses SSH. So now in this video, we will transfer the data using rsync. So what does rsync do? Basically, it synchronizes your source directory with your destination directory. So let's understand by doing it. So right now we are in our remote computer, remote computer and we will see the contents of it. So here we have three files and two folders and folders are named A and B while we have three files and in destination folder we have, in the source folder we have three files and two folders but the names of the folders are different. So we will just try doing rsync. So the command is rsync followed by hyphen r for ensuring the directories will also get transferred. And then the source directory. So here we are already in source directory. So we will be using dot slash and then an asterisk mark just to include every, um, all the contents of the source directory and then destination address. So username of the destination and the IP address of the destination and then destination folder here we have to include tilde as well which represents home directory so the folder is inside home and now we will just press enter so what is it doing right now it basically synchronizes the contents of the dest of the source folder so let's see what all contents are there now we have these two directories in addition with in addition to the directories of files we already had so let we can see we had this earlier now these remain intact And also we have these untitled folder 2 and 3 which came from the source folder. So this is how we synchronize two folders and this is one of the best way of transferring the data. And if, you're, if you just want to transfer it once, this is a perfect way of transferring. Thank you for watching the video.